little hockey. So, I mean, if you want something changed, then uh, you should really make sure that you're doing your best as well to change things. Because people love to complain but do nothing about it. Is that too real? That might be too real. Waters Night League will take over. I think the Night League is a fantastic idea. I think, you know, Night League, obviously it's not... At least there's a competition for everybody so that people aren't left out of Night League, but at the same time, the people that are on can participate in, you know, a less laggy, more competitive Zelda hockey. I think it's a great idea. Professor X now taking this, giving it up to Spruance. Spruance off the bottom wall. Coming in and holding it, deciding not to pass. Instead, he's going to drive it himself. Good shot. Zots will stop that, though. And flash. <laughs> probe All Star voting poll. If there was a Probe All Star voting poll, I would be top Probe player, NA. <laughs> what the fuck? Only one sub per period. What are you talking about? Hold, please, twist to AFK. Well, Zots should uh, hold it. Shoot the J. <laughs> what does that mean? And I guess Zots will hold this so that we can get Dagius in instead of the AFK Twista. What the hell, Reputed? <laughs> uh. Reputed. Professor X stripping it. Professor X is, is one of the new players helping out with the Twitch channel on highlighting VODs and you know make put exporting it to the YouTube channel and I think he's done a fantastic job there. Reputed now coming in with Dagius. Dagius hitting off the bottom post and Dagius is gonna get a bunch of shit from Kurt for that post. I ride Tom's mom's flying V. I'm glad you're so mature, Rush. Fucking reputed. Dagius does not get past Spruant. I see your screen is artifacting a little bit. Really? Looks good to me. Spruant. And that goes off the bottom post. Now, Rasp. Rasp is a pro leaguer? <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. Kelvin. Getting past Wrath. Gives it up for Flash, but Rep is going to put this off the bottom side. Rasp, Reputed, and Dagius. You could play this in ZHL and probably still beat the Yetis. <laughs> like, what? And Dagius coming in. Kelvin. Trying to get past Reputed. Makes his move too early, though. Spruance will take this puck. Challenged by Rasp. Spruance taking a shot right into Zots, who is stone cold. And now Kelvin to flash, flash. Dagius putting that out of the way of the net. I feel like playing Steam games. If you guys want to play some Steam games, you should message me. Rasputin up for Reputed. Reputed back to Rasp. And now Zots <laughs> misses the puck. Oh, this is a classic Pro League game. Dagius coming in versus Professor Spinning, putting it off the post once again. And now we're... Dagius, good job collecting that. Spins, oh, we did see that move before. Okay, we've seen some of this before still, but well, regardless. Who are you, Kagaroshi? Kagaroshi is Kagaroshi. <laughs> Dagius. And that'll do it for our first period. Oh, well, maybe not. Rep and Spruance. Spruance takes a shot on his own net. But that'll do it. Tarot teaches the romantic arts. <laughs>
Uh, 90% of dating is really just making the first move. <laughs> That's really all it is. And reputed. Boosting forward. Bottom side. Gets rid of it. Reputed takes it back. Coming in versus Calvin. Calvin shields it. And now Spruance will get past Daggius. Stay easy, Dags. Spruance giving it to Kagaroshi, who decides he doesn't want to catch that pass. And now Daggius. Daggius to Reputed. Reputed takes a shot. Blocked by Spruance. Rasp to nobody. And a shot outside the cage. Kagaroshi getting through reputed. Trying to get through Rasp as well. He does! And he loses control. And now Dagius will grab this puck. Dagius to Rep. Rep Flash strips it. Flash gets it back. <laughs> Flash still having control of this. Gives it to Spruance, and Dagius takes that. Dagius over to Rep. One-timer shot taken by Kelvin behind the net. Challenged by Rep, but Kelvin gets plenty of space to get back into his net. And he will hold it like a little pussy. Dagius versus Flash. Dagius coming to the slot. Takes a shot right into Spruance. Reputed will grab this. Give it up for Rasp. Rasp coming in versus Kaga. Rasp! He still has it! Can he get a shot off? He puts one off Kagarochi's shield. Dagius. Oh. Flash equals Darth Gandhi. Oh, I didn't know that. Spruance to Doorman. Doorman coming in. Crossing the net. Zots is there. Zots is my number one biggest fan. And now Flash versus Rasp. Flash on the bottom side. Doorman at the goal line. Decides to go behind the net. Recharging his Z, Doorman is, but instead gives it to Rasp. Rasp is now going to have a little bit of a breakaway. Take a shot, though. That was not very well aimed. Kaga's going to have no problem stopping that. And now Spruance on the top side will uh, give it to Flash. Wow. This game is still 0-0, by the way, in case you can't tell, because the replay shit is in the way, and I don't actually remember how to get rid of it. Oh! No! Oh, hey, look at that! It's gone! Perfect. Flash coming in. And Rasp, again, is going to be able to take a shot. But he puts it right in the door, man. And now Spruance will take this. If and when I do get subbed, says Calvin, I can only skate. <laughs> Can't be trusted in that. Spruance. On the bottom side. Oh, God, I'm tired. Rep. Stripped by Spruance. Spruance over to Flash. Rath. Rasp actually gives it up. Dagus is going to take this and put it off the back side. Doorman. Infinite Zots. Zots with a good save as the red team crosses the net there. And now Rath, uh, Rep sorry, is going to take it. Flash is challenged by Dagus. And end of the second coming up. And reputed... But Kagaroshi will ice this down, and that will do it for our second period. Stay easy, Prime. No GG trade, says Rush. <laughs> uh, I can't believe Rush is still talking about that. I feel like Rush cares more than Prime does about that. Just, just saying. It was a stupid call, but I don't really care anymore. You really want to get into this right now? We could. It's not really worth either of our time. Kelvin. 
Rasp takes this puck. Reputed. Spruance. Taken by Rep. Rep has a little bit of a breakaway here. Does take it. Looking for a shot. And Kaga in place. And now Kelvin. Dagius is going to take this puck. Give it up to Rasp. Defensively. And now Rasp has plenty of time to find a lane somewhere. Gives it up for Dagius. Reputed. <laughs> okay. Alright. Cool. Crush accepting something doesn't make doesn't matter. It's about the deadline. It's not about whether a crush not or not accepted it. Not even I would have the power to accept a trade after the deadline. There's a deadline specifically for the reason to force you to make a decision prior to the deadline. You miss the deadline and you accept that. You've stated it multiple times. Dagius has stated it. Kurt has said it. Stealth has said it. The deadline was missed. Therefore, the trade does not count. Is that really so hard? Jesus, I'm not even excited about that. Rep scored a goal. He could have just written it on the forums. Or you could have done it, like, you know, like yesterday or the day before. Like, you, it, it doesn't... It's not my responsibility to make sure that Dagius can sign on before, before 3 p.m. Pacific time. So I really just don't want to hear it. Dagius off the bottom wall to Rasp. Rasp boosting to the slot. And now Rasp puts it into Spruance. Tarot's mad because everyone thinks he's a ter terrible commission. No, not really. I think we already talked about this before, you know. If somebody wanted to do a better job, they would let me know. And they would step up. And I've offered that multiple times, but it hasn't happened. So, uh... Yep. You were carving up in the slopes in Utah. Right, so that's, I mean, that's on you. If you wanted to make a trade, you would have done it before the deadline, knowing that you had to leave the, the uh, country. You had Twitch access. You also had forum access. So therefore, you know, you could have done it. And really, it's, it's your responsibility to do it before the deadline. <laughs> this does not make sense to you guys. Okay, I'll be commission. And I'll accept trade. Okay, cool. Glad you're so mature about this. Dagius taking this puck in the corner. And he's going to kill some time here. And now Dagius still bitch walking a little bit. Starting to skate this up. Gives it to Rasp. Rasp. Coming in. And the shot right into Kagaroshi. I guess was an unable to log on. Things happen, Tara. That's why we don't understand. There has to be exceptions to all rules. <laughs> there has to be an exce exception to a deadline. So should I let other teams make trades past the deadline as well? Then why even have a deadline? Right? What a shot by Spruance. Hitting the top post there and going in. Great goal to tie this up. Reputed. Boosting it to the bottom. And now reputed hitting the post himself, but can't get the bounce in. Spruance now giving it to Kelvin. Dagius strips it. Dagius up for Rasp. Rasp has reputed. Doesn't pass it. Instead, Spruance will take it. it. It's not that he wasn't able to log on. It doesn't matter. It's, it's up to Dagius to get that done before he leaves for the trip. If he wants to do that. He knew the deadline was there. It wasn't like I imposed it days before. And he could have posted on the forum. So there's an alternate method. And uh, ultimately, like I said, the deadline was there. He chose to not make a trade before he left for his trip. Therefore, the fact that Dagius could not log on to StarCraft is really not my problem whatsoever. The real issue is, is Kurt trying to make that trade and Stealth and not the two owners. Dagius, nice goal to tie it up with uh, less than 10 seconds left. I'm just letting Prime know that he's wrong. and I mean, it's, it's just amazing that he doesn't understand. It's like if, for example, let's say... Uh, 
let's say you were in school and you had a project due Friday and you knew it was due Friday for about a week and uh, and you know you show up on Friday and you don't have your project done but you're like oh well you know I, I did it after the deadline that counts right that you know there should be exceptions your teacher would tell you to fuck off and that you get a zero on the assignment like <laughs> The teacher wouldn't say, oh, you got it after the deadline. Oh, I can make an exception for that. You know, like that. No, it was your job to get that done before the deadline. Doesn't matter if you decided to go skiing in Tahoe or, you know, couldn't log on to StarCraft. Like, that's not my issue. This is an arcade game on StarCraft 2. If you don't want to take this seriously or the deadline seriously, again, that's also on you. <laughs> Just saying. And the fact that you don't see that is really just sad, and I really hope that you don't hold a job that has deadlines, because you'll just ignore them. And now we're in overtime, so I care more about this. Flash coming in, rep, to steal it. And Rasputin. Does come in. Kaga uses his shield. Rasp trying to get through the defense. Does kind of get there, but Flash does strip it. And now, you could have deadlines on Sunday when all is online. But the deadline was on Sunday. It was on 3 p.m. Pacific Time, Sunday. <laughs> oh, this is like arguing with like someone with like an IQ of 70. It's just, it's just frustrating. Spruance behind the net. Coming in, trying to boost across. Dagius, nice defensive play to cut that off. Are we going to actually go to a shootout here? I hope not. Reputa takes his puck, shoots! 1.75 seconds left. And he wins it. Wow. Long one-timer. And uh, that'll do it for the game. Dagius taking home this crown. One goal, one assist. Good job to Dagius. Making that pass to win the game. Or was that Rath? Or was that Rep? Shit, I don't even remember. Um... Plus four for Daggies. Good job. Daggies definitely carrying his team there. Spruance, Flash, Kelvin, Kaga, Thorman, and Professor X getting a little bit of time as well. 